Nigeria prides itself for having the largest wetlands in Africa and third largest mangrove forest in the world. These provide a natural habitat for several aquatic species. Niger Delta wetlands are prospects for ecotourism, crop pollination, food production, and climate regulation. The theme of this year's World Wetland Day is wetlands and human well-beings. The wetlands also are a, a major source of carbon sequestration in our ecological system. Like they help to absorb um, carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, thereby giving us the requisite oxygen for uh, survival. The oil is coming from there. We have uh, fishes, we have forestry, we have so many other things that are coming from the uh, 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 Niger Delta environment. However, oil pollution, land reclamation and dredging has negatively affected the wetlands. This has made it imperative for the preservation of the wetlands for sustainable management of biodiversities, including those of mangroves. If you see the wetland as part of you, you won't destroy it. If you go into our communities, the only places you find precinct forests are in the sacred groves, the juju bush. So I think the government should make a deliberate effort to protect these sacred groves. How? Have them mapped out and gazetted. Farmers in rivers and Bielsa states are also encouraged to take advantage of the wetlands for rice production in the ongoing agricultural revolution. In Portacot, Robinson, Derateide, NTA News.